Hey everybody, welcome. <laughs> and um, paid a lot for that special effect. Uh, did you like it? Okay. Um, now I thought uh, I do have a lot of stuff to show, but I thought um, might as well start showing it and uh, just plowing through and showing what I got here. So. I'm going to start showing um, some of my CD collection, but first off, since today is Sunday, as it were, um, I was keeping my fingers crossed that today would be the first day of the year that the Browns would win, and they would get a win, but... All the crossing the fingers, I guess, uh, didn't really help. You, you got to do something, guys. You, you get, you can't, uh, you can't leave it all on me. No, <laughs> okay. No, they, um, they didn't win. Uh, they're now 0 and nine. That's a wonderful start. Okay. Hope everyone's doing superific out there. And uh, I'm going to be showing some of my CD collection here. See how we go. And I'll start plowing through here to show you what I got. I do have a lot of interesting things to show, but the only way, obviously, you're going to see them in, uh, unless I start showing them. So I just start showing a, a little bit of everything and uh, eventually somebody will find something fairly interesting and this one we're going to be focusing on CDs so here we go okay and okay. first one um, this is um, Sinatra greatest hits and uh, I found this in um, Goodwill I was walking through Goodwill just taking a little gander see what kind of interesting stuff they had in there and this is like brand new guess how much I paid for this no you take a guess no, no, no. No, it wasn't that much either. I pay 49 cents for this. I was like, 49 cents? And it sounds, there's like nothing wrong with it. I'd get that all day long. A lot of his like love songs in that. Real great added to my collection. Okay. And a great transition from uh, Frank Sinatra. And the next one I, is uh, Rolling Stones uh, Still Life from their 81 tour. I don't know if you can see that. That was the one they opened up with, uh, Take the A-Train. Very cool uh, live album there. Show you what else I got. Uh, this is a Chicago. It was put on, on a lower... Uh, a lower um, release label it's a live recording of them um, because it's it's okay it doesn't sound like it's the best recording at all
Okay, more interesting stuff to show you. Um, this is um, next up. This is introspective uh, beetles. And what that is, it's the first um, six songs, I believe, is uh, the Star Club. And then uh, seven, there's a long interview on here. Is there some of the stuff on there? That's an interesting CD. Beatles introspective. Some kind of interesting um, interviews by uh, of Paul talking about the uh, Revolver album. Okay. Then up next, seventies hits, classic rock. A lot of groovy stuff on here from the seventies. Like to see what's on there. I'll give a shout out to a couple of the pretty cool songs in here. Uh, America's Sister Golden Hair and Al Stewart, um, The Year of the Cat. Also has the Guess Who. Um, do an American Woman, uh, Free All Right Now, um, see what else is on here, uh, Mountain Mississippi Queen, um, Doobie Brothers China Groove, um, Foreigner Head Games, um, Eric Burden uh, Spill the Wine, a bunch of cool stuff. Okay, another one that I like listening to sometimes, has a good sound to it, uh, AM Gold 1969, can you dig it? Mm. I could see this better, the stuff that's on there. You got hair by the Costals on here. These eyes uh, by the Guess Who. Um, uh, Brooklyn Bridge, the worst that could happen to me. And a bunch of other incredibly groovy songs. There's a little article right there. Okay. AM Gold, 1969. Okay. Now we'll just transcend into the next one. This is like this is uh, heavy on Christmas now. Okay. Yeah, this is a pretty good uh, uh, CD here.
Okay. This was a CD that was put out by a company called Direct Source. It was just the best, called Best of Chuck Berry. They have on it um, all his big hits, as you can see. As they say, no filler. Johnny be good. No particular place to go. Carol um, and school days, of course. A lot of things that that Chuck did was was incredible. Um, but that's a great CD to listen to. And of course, this one, a photograph, the very best of Ringo Starr. Kind of looks like um, me, Mr. Mayo. I'll pick out a, uh, at least three of the songs on here. Um, he does um, Photograph, uh, Back Off Boogaloo, early 1970. I think he does, uh, oh, when I, early 1970s on here. It's a, it's a good CD to, of Ringo, of a lot of his big, big hits that he's had over the years, and they kind of squished up all of his hits in one uh, CD. There's another song I was trying to think that they did. Oh, Never Without You, that tribute he did with for George. That's, that's pretty good. I like that song. You can see all the other cool songs that's on here. I gave it a thumbs up for Ringo. Okay. And this one I bought at a um, music store, Frank Sinatra Trilogy. I said, oh boy, special value. It says here, yeah, you know why it was a special value? Because they only were selling one of the CDs. It's a, it's a two CD, because um, this was a two album set, but they, it must have got broken up. And here it's on sale. And I realized, yeah, I wonder why it was on sale. Only got part of the album. So, what's on here? It does sound pretty good though, but it probably was pr broke, but they sh should have st still s sold it as one unit, not. Yeah, oh, we got volume two in it now. And another CD. This is the Millennium Collection of 